so we're doing an overnight school-wide field trip to Sanghao Farms, which is an organic dairy farm. Cows and goats and chickens and bunnies. And we have to ride the bullet train to get there. So we're at the train station, SRT um, bullet train train station. We're gonna take the train for an hour and a half um, to get to Sanghao Farms for our first school-wide overnight field trip. So this is the train station and there's places to eat. Um, and there's about 70 of us going on this field trip and we're going to get to feed and pet the animals and pick some strawberries and make some bread and make some cheese. I'm just going to go to the hotel and I'm just going to sit down, take a nap. That's not and what get you're going to do. This is our art teacher, teacher Sunjung. There's Matt. There's Sunny and a student. And now we're just waiting for the whole crew. We'll get on the train. The bullet train goes over 200 miles per hour. 330 kilometers an hour. This will be our first experience on the bullet train. Okay, the crew is showing up. <laughs> the crazy American teacher. Look, somebody's hiding behind you. Uh, yeah. So we are getting to our train, and what's interesting is you don't even have to show your ticket to get on the train. They only check your ticket if there's like a seating problem, like if somebody says they're sitting in your seat or something. So our train is, um, we are platform one, and we are seat seven C and D, nine C and D, ten C and D. So we have tickets, but you don't have to show it or check it. Interesting. Oh, it does look like you can walk between the, the cars too. So we're heading to platform one. This is such a long train. students and parents all scattered throughout the train <clears throat> but we have made it so the bullet train will take about an hour and a half and then from there we have a bus it's about 40 minutes in this train I think I said this earlier it'll go over 200 miles per hour so nice comfy seats we have a little tray there's a magazine
have made it and now we're gonna catch a bus. Much nicer weather here. It was lightning and thundering. And we are here. Yeah! So interesting. Uh, we got off the train. We're coming to catch our bus and they're doing a fire drill. So there were these really loud sirens. <laughs> So our first experience, let me tell you, the train is so smooth. You have no clue you're going that fast. And then you get off to a fire drill. So now we're on the bus. Look at that. It's the love bus. Hmm. Wow. Do you want to sit? Okay, wait. Fancy bus. Okay, so we're on the love bus. Uh, okay. Miss Miller wants me to sit by her. <laughs> Shiny and. I don't think. Is that how it goes? Watch tonight, put a capital I next to it. About a 30 minute bus trip. This is the hotel at the farm that many of us are staying at, but the students are staying in a brand new, not even opened yet, glamping area with tents, fancy uh, tents. And we got invited to come and um, be the first ever to experience their glamping. So we get to stay um, before it's even officially open. So I think parents and teachers are staying in the hotel and students are staying in the glamping facilities. is we're taking a tour, two tours of the farm. We took it off. We are at the restaurant for lunch. Benjamin does not want his mom sitting with him. There's some more little sheep here. Oh, look at the baby. Oh, ho, ho, ho. checking out the animals that they've got on the farm. Not the best weather, but bye bye bunny. So again, it's an organic farm and they're gonna show us how they process the milk and cheese. And here are some of the cows. So we've got an activity we're about to do. The kids are about to um, 
plant some things in the little planters. Oh, strawberries. <clears throat> so, we've seen some sheep and goats. We still have not checked into um, our accommodations yet, and we've all gotten poured on. So, uh, anyway, it's still pretty fun. They are planting strawberry plants and picking strawberries, and then I think they learn to bake like a little strawberry cake. So, oh, look at that. Oh, he's got a scratch. He found a pipe. That's a good idea, Cal. <laughs> That's a good idea. Scratch and post. <laughs> Scratch that. Oh, yeah. Scratch that neck. Sure. Oh, I don't want to. Gee, wait. And there's a bunny loose in the. <laughs> Ooh, hello, bud. Hello, buddy. Hello. Oh, thank you. Okay, we are putting a strawberry cake together. And the directions are all in Korean. This is our life. So we just kind of we just kind of go with the flow. Very nice. Very nice. Nobody's really looks like her. Did you see good Elijah? We are in our room, so adults are staying at the hotel. And it's very um lofty like. So the wall is cement. And it's like a little two-story thing. Here's the bathroom. Big shower. Sink. Toilet. It's very, um, what would you call this? What would you call this? Like, I don't know. Little coffee nook. <clears throat> Not rustic, what am, industrial, very industrial. This looks like something you cook on. Really high with skylights. Here's our view. There's this little couch. No, there's not. And then stairs up to Eli's bed. Very cool. Okay, we're gonna explore up <clears throat> hmm. Up the stairs to the little loft bed area. Oh, that's cute. And then, I don't know what this is, probably for another bed. Doesn't it look like? Very groovy. Eli will be sleeping in the closet. We're heading to dinner now. There's a goat on a fence. You don't see this kind of expanse of land uh, in Seoul. And there is our hotel up there.
I'm not even sure where we are actually, like what city. <laughs> but the weather has improved and now we're heading to barbecue, which I think here means Korean barbecue. Here comes the crew for dinner. They have checked into their glamping tents. So I guess there's a wedding here. Mm. Okay, so now we're going to walk back to the glamping area and I'll show you guys the tents. So I think I said this earlier in the video. They have a brand new glamping place. It doesn't open till 1st of June, but we have a partnership with Songha Farms and uh, we've our STEM and art classes have made solar lights for all of their tents and so they invited us to come the weekend before the glamping area officially opens and we get to be the very first people ever to stay in the glamping area. So we're at the glamping area. Let's check out the tents. Really cute. Um, PCA Korea, look. Ah. Oh, the screaming. Nice Hello. porch areas. Hello. There's Wuju. <clears throat> really nice patio areas. That's big. Okay, let's check one out. Oh, are these the bathrooms? Yeah, they're in building right now, though. Okay, let's see. Nice big porch. Okay. Nice teak furniture. Take the shoes off. Okay. Step up. Oh. Cool light fixture. Oh, totally retro. <laughs> Look at that. That's super cool. Little thing to hang. Two huge beds shoved together. <clears throat> Air conditioner. Very cute. Super cute. We are the first ever to stay. I think that's an air purifier. It's like yeah. two queen, at least queen beds pushed together. It's supposed to be able to fit four. The porch area is very big. Oh, y'all are eating the desserts she made. Mm -hmm. Nice. Yeah, these are very nice. So it's a shared bathroom and shower facility. <clears throat> and then we're bringing them the solar lights that our students have made. And there's gonna be, I think at least one in every tent. So this is the hallway of our rooms, and then there is this really big outdoor space. So we spent the night. This is day two. Maybe they hold ceremonies or something. I'm not really sure. Really nice weather today. I mean, it's such a different, um, scenery than, than Seoul where we're just covered with buildings. Really nice. But this is a nice little touch. Eli was out here playing with his friends yesterday. So 
So today we are signing a, an MOU, a partnership between PCA Korea and Songhao Farm. And this is the signing of the MOU. Here's everybody here for the signing. Hi. Matt and I did not know this was going on. Hence him in a ball hat and brave shirt, and I'm in Georgia Bulldogs. So that right there is the chairman of our board, BCA Korea, Dr. Lee. Um, is one of our main investors in PC in Korea. trying to get all the kids together for a picture. Look at this. So this is the view from <clears throat> out front of our hotel. So you can see cows over there. So they're starting a farming school here and they want to use, um, you know, solar and like reusable smart technology for it. And so that's why they're partnering with our school. But this is just beautiful. <laughs> so we're doing sausage making now. Uh oh. Oh. Y'all gotta mix it with your hands. Yeah, they want to. <laughs> with your hands. You don't want to touch it? Okay, well, it's not. It's sausage. Go, Daniel. There you go. The parsley and the ice, mix it together. Wow. Y'all are really getting into it. <laughs> oh, so gross. So gross. You're touch your jeans again. Eli just wiped them off with the jeans. That's why you have an apron on. So you get salmonella. So in here we're making bread. Green bread. Matcha. Green. Okay, there's the sheep yeah. intestines that the sausage will go into. Doesn't look like matcha in intestines. What is that? Sheep intestine. The innards guts. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> okay, we're back on the bread making side. 
Su Yun's making bread gloves. You are very violent with it. Good trip.